If you could tell yourself from the first day of classes anything that you've learned about college or just in general now, what would you say? I would say not to take more than 16 hour credits. That's one thing. Be sure that you're on time for your classes. Attendance does matter. <laughs> I would say, like, thinking back, like, how I would, like, feel, like, freshman year if I ever, like, goofed a little bit, like, made a mistake, and I would just let myself, like, get beat up over it. I would just say, just don't sweat the small stuff when it comes to being a freshman. Uh, you're going to mess up. I mean, you're pretty much still a kid at that point, you know? Like, you just got out of high school, you know? That's where you're supposed to learn and make mistakes comfortably. But as long as you're getting all your stuff done, you're not neglecting your responsibilities, and you manage to fall short somewhere, I wouldn't beat yourself up too much about it. You know, it's just a learning experience and it's something that helps you grow as a person to kind of get past that. Um, and yeah, like kind of like try and get involved in things. Because uh, college is similar to, it was similar to my high school a little bit, but not, not too much. But it is a, it's, it's, a, it's a different experience. You're on your own. Your mom's not here, your dad's not here, your grandmother's not here. Uh, it's, it's, it's basically living in that, that adult life, living it up. And uh, I don't know, I just kind of wish, I just kind of wish I uh, didn't apply for uh, engineering. I was going into engineering first. That was a mistake, but uh, I'm on the right path now, so that's always good. Oh yeah, and, and, and know exactly what you want to do. Don't come to college if you don't, that's a mistake. That is a mistake. The, the, the switching and stuff is, don't do that. Don't do that. I'd be like, hey man, you should keep going to the gym. <laughs> I think that would be on there. And I think I would also, I would encourage myself to to go out and try to join like a club. I feel like that's super important and get a house. I feel like once I got out of my house, or I got out of the dorms and kind of like started finding other organizations, I felt like I definitely had like an independent side of myself and also had like a connected side. So I think that was like the two key things that really like moved me forwards in like my college experience. Uh, I would say take care of your mental health. I feel like there's a stigma around if you have like anxiety or depression, take care of that. Uh, taking care of your mind is just as important as taking care of your body and going to class. Definitely for this semester I'd say that it's going to be really hard. Probably harder than anything you've ever done and it will be because of school. Um, there are a lot of things that happened in my personal life this year that I wish I had been prepared for but you kind of never are. A lot of personal stuff just comes up and you have to deal with it as you go. Um, I would just tell myself, like, you know, you can get through it. You can definitely make it, even if it's super hard. It's just one more day at a time and you have a lot of people who want to support you and care about you and um, everything will be pretty okay in the end, even if it's not perfect. And I think that's the the major piece of advice I could give myself from not just this semester but probably all previous semesters and all of my semesters I'm about to take too. Yeah.